This is how to set up a 2728. Right. First, we want to go to the gateway and log in. I'll give you the user names and passwords to log in. When it's brand new out of the box, you want to make sure you go to the 192 address. Go to system, software, update and choose your file. So there's two different folders that you have. You have a copper and a fiber. If you're wanting, it, yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. If you're wanting to set it up for a copper uplink, then you go to copper, you fiber, and fiber. So let's go to fiber. You want to download this one right here. This is the one with like a little uh, disk image format, and it's uh, a software. So let's update. And this is where I'm going to pause it and then just come right back up. It takes about 60 seconds for it to upload it from your computer to the uh, 2728. And then it takes about three minutes total for it to come back. All right, we're back. I'm going to log back in to the address. And this time we're still going to system. Um, but we're going to back up and restore. It's going to drop down, go to restore, and we're going to choose another file. This time, we're going to choose the other one. We're not going to choose a disk file. We're going to use the one that ends in config right here. And we're going to restore settings. And this time, it takes about 40 seconds for the 2728 to download the config file and about 2 minutes and 30 seconds I think total and then uh, I'm going to pause it again and we'll come right back alright and we're done so after uh, it boots back up this time our gateway has changed to 10.250 um, it will have the same username but a different password uh, to log in and to check our work we'll go to configuration vlan and we'll check to make sure if we did a fiber uplink that it's under fiber um, right here if we were doing copper it would just be over here um, and some of these numbers have changed if you looked at this before um, so but now that's all done it should be good to go um, let's go and uh, now that we're in wireless, we want to change our names here. Um, just call it Fast Fiber. Um, apply and save. It takes just a couple seconds for that to. All right, then we go to security um, right here, which is under 2.4. We're still under 2.4. Um, call this like Blue Shoe. One, apply and save, and once it comes back up. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to copy and paste this to the 5G, um, but I'm going to label this as a 5G. You definitely want to be able to tell the difference between the 2.4 and the 5G just in case someone's setting up like a bunch of you know, like Sonus or Chromecast. Uh, you don't want them all on different networks or, you know, then you'll have to log in and out of your networks to, you want to make sure you can at least tell the difference between the two. So you apply and save that. And then go to security and type in the password here. Push one. And that's it. That's how you set up your 2728.